Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW or the Weight Watchers personal point plan. Can you believe that this year is almost over? I don't know about you, but 2021 absolutely flew by. I discovered a lot of new food favorites over the course of this last year, and every year I like to put out a video of my top 20 WW food for the previous year. But because this is 2021, today we're going to do 21 of my favorite WW friendly foods. And I am so excited to share these with you. I had a lot of new, really good food finds this year that it was actually hard for me to narrow it down to 21. But these 21 are my all time favorite WW friendly foods. So if you are excited, give this video a big, huge thumbs up. And if you're new or you're not yet subscribed, I would absolutely love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell next to it so you never miss a single upload. I will make sure that all of the foods that I share with you that aren't at your local grocery store are linked down below for you, as well as nutrition coaching, where I offer personalized macros and calories, as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching, links and discounts to all of my other favorite things, as well as my Facebook group. We'd love to have you join us over there for New Year's or inspiration throughout the entire year of 2022. 2022. So head on over and join us there. So without further ado, let's jump into the top 21 foods for 2021. today's video, I went back and forth on whether or not I wanted to physically show you the food if I have it on hand or if I just wanted to pop images up on the screen. And I decided to go ahead and just pop images up on the screen. All 21 of these foods I consume on a very, very regular basis. Some of these foods I consume every single day. So these are my top 21 foods. One of my favorite healthier sweet treats that I discovered this year is from Charlie and the peanut butter factory. These are little peanut butter cups made from real nut butter. They have really good fun flavors. They offer ones that have cookies included. They offer full size and little mini size. The mini size is about the size of a mini muffin and the full size is about the size of a regular baby Reese's peanut butter cup, just a little bit thicker. These are really good. You're able to get in some protein, healthy fats, and fiber with these and they're just a fantastic sweet treat. You store these in your freezer and when you're ready to eat them, you let them defrost for a few minutes and then you pop them out of the little plastic container and they're absolutely delicious. I have tried the cookie ones, the regular ones, the minis, the big, I've tried them all and all of them are absolutely incredible. They offered a discount for the Charlie and the Peanut Butter Factory Cups. I'll make sure that information is down in the description box as well. But if you love peanut butter and you love sweet treats, definitely grab these. Number two are Clio bars. I love the Clio bars. What they are is they are a Greek yogurt chocolate wrapped bar. They kind of remind me of a mix between cheesecake and ice cream. That texture on the middle in the middle is cheesecake. They're wrapped in chocolate. They even have yogurt coated ones. You can find these at your local grocery store. I've often been able to find these at Costco or Sam's Club as well, or you can order these off of the Clio Bar website. They also have minis and the minis of course are going to be less points than the full size. They're just a really good sweet treat. They give you that little bit of protein protein and they also satisfy that sweet craving. Number three is one of my very, very favorite new food finds this year. This is something I eat every single day and these are the Verb energy bars. These little bars are packed with so much goodness. They have good ingredients. They contain 65 milligrams of caffeine derived from green tea, so naturally derived caffeine. They are fantastic pre-workout, post-workout, or in the afternoon when you just need a little afternoon pick me up, these come in really handy. They're 90 calories, three points, and they have some amazing, amazing flavors. I love the red velvet cake. The cinnamon roll actually has drizzled frosting on top of it. The chocolate peanut butter tastes like a no-bake cookie. 
They're all just absolutely incredible. You can pick these up on a fantastic deal when you're a new customer to Verb, so I'll leave all of that information in the description box. But like I said, this is something I love, the taste, the texture. I love that little bit of caffeine in there. And again, I eat these pretty much every day. Next up are the Heavenly hunks. Now I just recently discovered these within the last few months. I bought a big bag of the birthday cake ones at Costco. I love these. They are a thick chunk of cookie. Basically that's what they are. They are a square thick chunk of cookie. They have good ingredients. They're not packed with all of the sugar that comes in a regular cookie, but they absolutely satisfy your sweet tooth. They're pretty good size, so one definitely does the trick. Really hard to overeat on these because they are so big and filling. I love the Heavenly Hunks. The birthday cake one was delicious. I've also tried the white chocolate cranberry, which is amazing, and their chocolate chip. All of the Heavenly Hunks, so good. You can find these at really most grocery stores, health food stores, and again, I did find mine at Costco. Next are the Orgain Clean protein shakes. So these are pre-made protein shakes. If you've been following my channel for a while, about a year ago, I stopped consuming a lot of sugar-free, fat-free, and I completely avoid carrageenan at all costs. Carrageenan is essentially an inflammatory and it's added to things as an emulsifier. So it helps make things thicker. So it's in a lot of protein shakes on the market, Fairlife, Premier, those all have carrageenan. You can also find it in weird things like cottage cheese, sour cream, and pretty much in all canned whipped cream and even in some coffee creamers. So I was on the hunt for an on-the-go protein shake that I could make protein coffee or profi out of or that I could have on the go when I just need to get in my protein and I discovered the Orgain Clean. These are really, really good. They are plant-based. They have several flavors. The vanilla is my absolute favorite and like the name says, they are clean ingredients. No carrageenan and really no questionable ingredients at all. I just picked these up off of the Orgain website. I'll link a discount down below for you but you can also find these at, again, your local grocery store or any health food store. But if you want to avoid a lot of the questionable ingredients in a lot of protein shakes, I highly recommend the Orgain Clean. Another sweet treat that I discovered this year are the Unreal. My favorite is the Unreal little chocolate covered coconut bites. This is literally a Mounds bar, a healthier version of a Mounds bar. They're small, so they're the perfect portion size, but they're enough to satisfy that need for a candy bar or that need for something sweet. I have found these time and time again at Costco. Of course, they have these in most grocery stores. And Unreal actually makes a lot of other really good products. They have a dupe for the M&M. They have some other types of little bites, but my favorite are the chocolate covered coconut. Circling back to protein shakes, protein powders, I have a pretty lofty protein goal every day that I have to get in. So I will gravitate towards protein shakes and protein powders a lot. But again, I'm really conscious of the ingredients in my protein powders specifically. And I have found not only the cleanest protein powder I've ever found, it is plant-based and it is a complete protein. A lot of protein powders on the market are not complete. There's a big difference between a complete protein and an incomplete protein. And Live Well is a complete protein. And she isn't your mama's plant-based protein powder. There is absolutely no chalkiness to this protein powder. It comes in several flavors, including coconut, chocolate, vanilla, and there's even an unflavored one. If you want to add that to things like oatmeal, Really anything that you don't want to added flavor to, the unflavored one comes in really handy. I use these for protein shakes. I add them into my oatmeal. The Live Well protein is so good. And like I said, it is the cleanest plant-based complete protein on the market. I will make sure that I link a discount as well for Live Well for you. My next food favorite is kind of an odd one, and this is ketchup. And this is the Primal Kitchen ketchup. Like I said, I try to avoid a lot of sugar-free, fat-free, but I also try to avoid a lot of sugar in general. And I wanted a cleaner, healthier, no sugar added ketchup. And I discovered the Primal Kitchen. Now it is a little bit more expensive than your traditional Hunts or Heinz that you find at your local grocery store. You can also find this at your local grocery store, but this no sugar added ketchup to me tastes the most authentic, like real ketchup. Even my husband 
who is a ketchup connoisseur loves this Primal Kitchen one. I buy this off the Thrive Market or I'll purchase it from my local health food store. You can also pick this up off of the Primal Kitchen website. I'll make sure all of that information is down below for you, but this ketchup is so good. I'm telling you, the ketchup connoisseur even likes this ketchup. In OG, a product that falls on my favorites list every single year are Built Bars. Now, Built Bar has really stepped up their game this last year. They've created some new, healthier options. They've created some better bars, in my opinion, overall. I am obsessed with the Built Puffs. It is like a chocolate-covered marshmallow. Think Russell Stouffer Easter eggs, bunnies, the marshmallow with the chocolate. That is the vibe from the Built Puffs. They are so good. They are one of my favorite desserts because you get in some protein with your dessert. Built Bar also came out with Built Balls, which are nut butter packed, kind of granola-like consistency little balls. I love these. And to my pleasant surprise, these have good ingredients. Now the Built Bar has okay ingredients, but the Built Balls have really, really good ingredients. Now the Built Balls come and go in availability. The Built Puffs come and go in availability, but I'll link Built Bar down below with a discount for you and free shipping. When you see either one of these pop up on their website, grab them. You really can't go wrong with any Built Bars, but these two products are my all-time favorites. I also love a good sparkling water. Another thing that I try to avoid is natural flavors. Now, even though it says natural flavors, natural flavors are actually artificial flavors. There isn't a lot of difference between artificial and natural flavors, so I do try to avoid those for the most part, and they're found in 99.9% .9 of sparkling waters. You really have two options on the market when it comes to sparkling water without natural flavor. So these are flavored with real fruit or fruit extract. Number one is Spindrift, which I actually really enjoy Spindrift, but this year I discovered Aura Bora Waters. You guys, this is the best sparkling water on earth. It is so so incredibly delicious. They have really fun flavors. My favorite is peppermint watermelon. And I know that that sounds weird. I know what you're thinking, but it is incredibly delicious. It is very peppermint forward. So it's refreshing. So good. This is a small business that actually launched in 2021. It has taken off like wild fire. I buy mine again on the Thrive Market as well as through the Ouroboros website and you can find very select flavors at Walmart. Not all of the flavors but I have seen a few flavors at Walmart. If you love sparkling water you have to try these. They are so good and I am obsessed with their nice clean ingredients. I don't know about you but I love a good bagel but bagels for breakfast or bagels in general just do not keep me full and satisfied. I feel like it just goes right through me and an hour later I'm hungry again. This is until I discovered Western Bagel. Now this is a frequent flyer in my top 20 foods throughout the last couple of years because these bagels are that incredible. They are very low calorie, low point, low carb, and they cure that craving for bagels, but they give you a punch of fiber and some protein, and they are way less calories and points than traditional bagel. You wanna to gravitate towards the alternative bagels. Now they do sell regular, full calorie, full fat, regular bagels on their website, but the alternative bagels and the alternative baglets, which are small baby mini bagels are the way to go. These are so low in points, so low in calorie, and I promise there is zero difference between these and a regular processed full of junk bagel. My favorites are the blueberry and I really like the cinnamon and the everything. Any of the little baglets, the one point bagels are super, super delicious. I'll link Western Bagel. They are an online business down below for you with 10% off. Now, if you follow my channel, you know that another one of my daily staples is my good culture cottage cheese. I'm a huge cottage cheese fan in general, but I don't like runny cottage cheese and I don't like the big chunked cottage cheese. Good Culture is incredible. Not only is it a thicker, smaller curd cottage cheese, it has absolutely phenomenal ingredients. Like I mentioned, you can even find carrageenan in cottage cheese, not in Good Culture. It is just real ingredients, no added anything to it, and the taste, the texture, just everything about the Good Culture is a million 
out of 10. They have a low fat, a full fat, and they have an extra full fat keto version. You can even buy them in individual little cups. I find these at most grocery stores. Target, any Kroger store is generally going to sell good culture, and I find them at most health food stores as well. If you love cottage cheese, this cottage cheese game changer. Now I'm a sweets lover. If you haven't already been able to tell from a lot of my top foods, I love sweets. But again, I try to avoid a lot of sugar in my daily diet. And so I instantly will gravitate towards smart sweets. I favorited these last year in my favorites. But Smart Sweets has come out with some new flavors that have really stole the show. I love their brand new cola gummies. They are so incredibly delicious. But my all-time favorite Smart Sweets are the watermelon slices. If you love the Sour Patch Kids watermelon slices, you're going to love the Smart Sweets. They are so, so good. It is candy literal candy and you can have the entire bag for about a hundred calories three to four smart points and it only has three grams of sugar but you would never know that it only has three grams of sugar and better yet it contains zero sugar alcohols they are so good my husband loves them i love them whenever i'm craving candy gummy candy i just grab a bag of smart sweets out of my pantry again you can find these at stores like target kroger and even at walmart or you can order them off of the Smart Sweets website, which is generally a little bit lower price. And there is a discount as well when you order off their website, so it can save you a little bit of money. I love a good Smart Sweet. You see me eat these pretty regularly. Now, another food swap I focused on this year was transitioning over from just traditional white processed bread to a bread that's a little bit healthier, a whole grain bread, a sprouted bread, one that actually has fiber in it and has a little bit of protein. And my all-time favorite new find go-to bread is the Trader Joe's sourdough bread. Now, the slices are a little bit smaller, pretty comparable to maybe a Sara Lee 45 calorie bread, but much denser and packed with really, really good ingredients. The best thing about this bread is it has some fiber. So it's going to help you reach your fiber goal. It is 90 calories per slice. It's delicious. I mean, truly, truly a huge step up when it comes to bread and a much more satisfying and filling bread than those really airy pockety breads that are reduced calorie. 90 calories, three points a slice, any day of the week. I want to share another protein powder that is a staple for me, and this is from the brand Devotion. Their protein powder is so good. It has fantastic texture, no chalkiness. The taste is out of this world. Now, it doesn't have as clean of ingredients as the Live Well, and it isn't a fully complete protein, but it is a great option for protein shakes, and it is, in my opinion, the best option for baking. So if you want to add protein powder to something you're baking, like maybe an oatmeal bake or a muffin or a bread, choose Devotion because it bakes really, really well. It doesn't separate, it doesn't change the consistency, and it adds the perfect flavor and sweetness to all baked goods. Again, this is a protein powder. I will pop in a protein shake as well, but it's a huge, huge win for baking with protein and really helping you get in your protein every single day, even in the form of a baked good. So I do have 10% off for devotion. That will be in the description box. Now here's another food I eat several times a week. This is another one of my favorite finds this year, and this is the Sam's Choice Chicken Apple Sausage. So Sam's Choice is a Walmart brand. This sausage, not only is it filling really good sized, delicious. It is full of nice, clean ingredients. So clean that this particular sausage is whole 30 approved. The only what could be seen as negative of this sausage is that it's pretty high in sodium, which is standard for really any processed meat or sausage. But if you want a delicious, super low point, good size protein pack sausage for 100 calories, three points, Definitely, definitely recommend the Sam's Choice. This is really the only type of sausage that I purchase for breakfast or lunch. It is so good. I mean, so delicious. I dice it up, cook it with some eggs for breakfast, pop it on the grill for dinner, or have it on a bun for a really delicious protein-packed lunch. Highly recommend. These sausages are hit and miss at some Walmart, sometimes they have them, sometimes they don't. When I stock up on them, I just pop them in the freezer and they last a long time and I make sure that I always have one on hand because they're that good. Next up is a water enhancer. I drink a lot of water, about a gallon a day, and 99% of the time, I just have fruit in my water, lemons or limes, to have that natural flavor. 
but sometimes I want a flavored water. Sometimes that will help cure hunger cravings or cure a sweet craving for me. And I try to stay away from things like Crystal Light just because of aspartame. And I recently discovered Everly. Now Everly is a water enhancer that is much, much more natural. And the flavor of this is so incredibly delicious. It is so good. They have several flavors. It comes in this cute little pouch. You pop the lid off and just pour the right amount into whatever size water bottle you're drinking. And it just adds really good flavor without a lot of the artificial sweeteners that just aren't the healthiest for you. I personally think it tastes better than Crystal Light and I feel a lot better having Everly in my water if I'm going to have a water enhancer. Another sweet treat that I'm obsessed with, I discovered at Target this year. These are the True Fru. Now what these are are frozen berries that are wrapped in one layer of white chocolate and one layer of regular chocolate. They're so good. They are clean, clean, clean ingredients. They're absolutely incredible. They are a little bit pricey. I believe they're about five to six dollars a bag, but it is well worth it because they're clean and they are delicious. My favorites in order, number one are the cherries. The chocolate covered cherries are so good. Number two are the blueberries. You get a lot of them for the points in calorie because they're smaller. And number three are the chocolate covered raspberries. This one just falls at the bottom because sometimes I find that the raspberry can be a little bit tart. But I love the true fruit. You can find them in the freezer section. I find them mainly at Kroger stores and Target and they are with a lot of the other frozen desserts like the pies and the cakes that are in the freezer section. If you haven't tried these, try these. Another favorite for me and something that I eat regularly throughout the week are the heat bars or the healthy eating all the time and go bars. This is a one woman small business and these bars, not only do they taste absolutely incredible, they are 100% clean ingredients and the macros chef's kiss on these bars. You cannot get a better macro profile than what is in these heat bars. They are generally peanut butter based. I will tell you right now, my favorite is the chia bar because not only are you getting a nice clean bar, you get the fiber and added protein from the chia seeds. And this particular bar has about 15 grams of protein where the other flavors have between eight and nine grams. My second favorite is the peanut butter with the cranberries. So good. You cannot go wrong with the healthy eating all the time and go bars. They're clean, they're healthy. They are only about 200 to 210 calories a piece. They actually can serve as a meal replacement. They're that filling and satisfying. I love these bars. I love supporting a small business. She did offer me 10% off for you guys. I'll put that down in the description box, but try these bars out. You will not be disappointed. Oh, and this is another bar my husband actually likes as well. And he doesn't really eat any proteiny, healthy things in general. And number 21, and my final favorite for 2021 are the Quest Loaded Taco Chips. Now I'll tell you right now, I do not like the Quest Chips. There isn't a single Quest chip that I like other than these loaded taco. I am not kidding when I tell you these taste like a taco. You have the crunchy chip that serves as like the taco shell and then the seasoning is literally a taco. It is so incredibly delicious. It's a regular tortilla chip. It doesn't have a weird taste, texture, or consistency like I find with a lot of the other Quest chips. I love to crush these up and put these on a taco salad or just a salad in general. Or if I'm craving a chip, this is my go-to because I have, because I get in a good amount of protein. They're lower in sugar. And in my opinion, they taste just as good as a regular potato chip. I buy all of my Quest chips either off of the Nutrition website, or I buy these off of the Thrive Market. I have seen these in some health food stores as well. If you haven't tried Loaded Taco, try Loaded Taco. Now I want to have an honorable mention because I talk about this so often on my channel and I've shared this again in so many of my top foods for the past years and that is the fiber gourmet pasta. This is a staple in my household. Not only is this pasta absolutely delicious, the taste and texture is better than traditional pasta. It's going to give you all of your fiber for the day. It is only 100 calories per two ounces, where traditional pasta is between 200 and 210 calories for two ounces. It's half the points. It's only three points. 
for the two ounce serving versus five or six points, and it packs seven grams of protein. We love fiber gourmet pasta, and they even make a macaroni and cheese that, dare I say, is equally as good as Kraft. It is so incredibly delicious, and it is packed with fiber. And eating fiber is not only important to help keep you full, satisfied, regular, but also you should have 25 to 30 grams of fiber every single day, and you can get that with one serving of Fiber Gourmet. I just love it so much. I had to throw it in here as an honorable mention. A lot of you love it. So many of you have reached out and thanked me for turning you on to the Fiber Gourmet Pasta. This is a product that is sold online. I buy it off of the Nutrition website because they have the best price and they have all of the shapes of pasta. There's elbows, linguine, AKA spaghetti, rotini, and penne. They have all of those shapes in stock on Nutrition. So I'll link Nutrition down there for you guys as well in case you haven't tried Fiber Gourmet. Definitely get the pasta. I promise you it will be a complete life-changing moment when you make your first batch of fiber gourmet pasta. So those are my top 21 foods of 20. 21. Like I said, I tried so many great, amazing foods over this last year, but these 21, 22 are the ones that I eat on a regular basis. I will, of course, have everything linked down below for you. Any discounts I can round up, I'll make sure those are in the description box as well. Definitely try these foods out. They are so good and they really make being on WW or being on a diet in general much easier and more sustainable when you have good, healthy foods that you enjoy, but also keep you full and satisfied. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a big, huge thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel or not yet subscribed, I would love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. Check out the description box for all the foods as well as nutrition coaching, links and discounts to all of my other favorite things. And don't forget, come and join my Facebook group. We are 20,000 members strong. It's very loving and supportive and we'd love to have you be part of it. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Here's to 2022 and I'll see you next time. Bye.